Chrissy, Sam and Brownie. It's a podcast bonus. Nova. Chrissy Swan, Sam Pang and Jonathan Brown. Chrissy's celebrity star. Scott Disick has rolled his Lamborghini. What? What a line. He's had a single car crash in Calabasas. Yeah, yes. Calabasas rolled, is... Rolled his Lamborghini. In LA somewhere, isn't it? He's all right, though, yes, guys. Yes, it is. Just before you think it's going to get worse, it's fine. Did he Scott- just pull the wing doors up and jump out? Actually, yes, he did. And an ambulance arrived and he refused treatment, which makes me think, no. what are you hiding, Scott Disick? What are you hiding? It's oh, a big crash, geez. a proper roll. He what? was absolutely... F- he wouldn't have been doing 60K an hour, Swanee. I wonder if he yawned. Oh, when, yeah. uh, when the paramedic said, do you need any help? Like he did <laughs> when we asked him a fashion question when he was, you know, in Spring Carnival where they, they bring out a, a, a random famous person. Yeah. He was that one year. He was too. Yeah. And this and is how... Dino, well, Dino the week before, Swanee, mm. to the Cox Plate, Dino mm. wore a beautiful suit mm. with white socks. Yeah. White anklet socks, my man. Show okay. off my little bulbous little ankles. Mm. He was, you were roundly criticised for that. But what did Scott Disick think? Bring it on. White socks back? Son of a bitch just openly yawned down the phone. Yawned. I think it was a fashion statement. Thanks, John. Thanks. I think it really stood the test of time. Um, I think he just was slow to get on board. It is strange, though. You don't want medical attention. It's all it is. What are you hiding, Scott Disick? What are you hiding? Nova. Chrissy Swan. Sam Pang. And Jonathan Brown. Chrissy's celebrity stuff. A bit of a solemn uh, celebrity stuff today. Very sad. Very sad. New Zealand singer Margaret Ehrlich has passed away at the age of 57. Now, I've got a soft spot for Margaret Ehrlich. Of course, she is the famous voice alongside Daryl Braithwaite in the unofficial Australian national anthem, Mm. The Horses. That's That's her, Brad. That's her. Amazing. What a voice. She was an absolute fixture in this country uh, in the late 80s and 90s. Always on Hey Hey at Saturday. She was too. <laughs> yeah. Safe hands on that show. I loved her and I can't choose safe hands. Not at all objectified. No. Two other songs of hers that I personally love. Two. Is this one. Love doesn't bring you out. That's, that's incorrect, by the way. Love does not bring you out of your shell. If anything, it makes you smaller. Mm. <laughs> that was big at the Huge. time. Huge. And what about this one? Oh my god, what is wrong with you? <laughs> my god. No, that's my it's touching. Like working shoes. With, it's like working with Linus or Pigpen from Charlie Brown. Just, the just bloody point. cloud I'm following just you around. I'm out that sometimes the lyrics aren't actually applicable to real life. Anyway, no, good point. It's good. They're good. They are, hey, Did thank you. Did she pass for, away? Had she been sick? She had yeah. been sick, yeah, for, for a couple of years with uh, with cancer. So, Vale, Margaret Ehrlich. It's a re- it was really shocking and sad to hear that this morning. Good to hear her other songs there too, Swanee. Yes, she's got a lot of them, actually. No. Nova. Chrissy Swan, Sam Pang and Jonathan Brown. Chrissy's Celebrity Star. Another mask was unveiled, unveiled last night on The Masked Singer. There's only four left. It's on again tonight. The great Shannon Noll was inside the Blowfly mask. This is his last performance. It's clearly Shannon Noll. Now that you know. But I reckon he blew everybody away with his rendition of um, Tina Arena's Chains. Wait for it. What a voice. Yes, Nolsey. You son of a bitch, Nolsey. And that was Abby, that popped Abby's cherry, guessing cherry. Whoa. She got him. She got him with a lot of encouragement from me, just quietly. Also, Nolsey was in Pang's chair this morning, yeah. early. Yeah. So, podcast the show. What do you mean in my chair? He sat in your chair. He sat in your chair in person. And he, Why? He should sit in the guest chair, nah, didn't he? your chair. And he looked good. We had the... Nolsey 7 till 9. That'd be all right, wouldn't it? Yeah, we needed Nolsey. He was good, good value. Nolsey, he revealed, too, that he played a game of football with his sons. 
in a uh, game of AFL with his uh, two adult sons there. Wow. It's been pretty good. Okay. Now, this is pretty exciting news. Shaquille O'Neal is uh, is coming to this fair city oh my God. live on stage for an uncensored interview, 7 p.m. Uh, this Thursday. You can order now on main event on KO to watch it with some snacky poozies from the comfort of your own home. And this time tomorrow, you guys are going to be talking to Shaquille O'Neal. Just for, just so clarify too, because I know we mentioned it at the time. I didn't get the interview. No. Nah. Just remember we mentioned it. It didn't happen. No, you fine. got an interview, which you're going to do today and we're going to yeah, play yeah, tomorrow, yeah. but you didn't get the, you know, emceeing on-air oh, interview. Yeah. Which what, was it feels like, what it feels like, what does it feel like to be the bridesmaids here? Hmm. Not great, John. Hmm. Who's doing it? Who is? Who's Mark gonna... Howard. Oh, Brownie's mate, the Howie. Oh. Howie got the duties. No. Howie oh, and Shaquille O'Neal. Oh, it's a Foxtel event, so Sam, unfortunately, Bonnie, Britain, not on the books at Foxtel. So Howie is oh, the, the go-to with all the cricket and footy stuff. Yeah. Howie will do a good job, but the level, it won't be He'll as entertaining. He's a great job. He's got Howie Gaines. He's Whatever. used to playing all those, uh, uh, talking to all those celebrity sports stars. There's no bigger celebrity sports star than Shaquille O'Neal. And as I say, mm. live on stage for an uncensored interview, 7 p.m. this Thursday. That's event viewing. Order now on main event on KO. And be listening to us tomorrow if you want to hear... What sort of chemistry Sam Pang and Jonathan Brown oh, would wow. have with Shaquille O'Neal? I'm guessing it's going to be pretty awesome, guys. I'm really looking forward it's to it. Cool, it's a cool thing to have happen to the show. Issy or Izzy? Issy? Izzy? You've <coughs> just won a no meet way. and greet and tickets to see Shaquille <laughs> O'Neal. Oh, my God. Thank you. Wow. Thank you so much. Fun. Good one, Izzy. And I think we've got another double, would you believe? Whoa. Paul from oh. Caram Downs. Clear your decks for Thursday night, my friend. You beauty. You beauty. You. Big Paul, what do you like about Shaq the most, old boy? Uh, he's just massive and can break a backboard in without trying. Exactly. My, my daughter told me that his feet are like a size... 23, 24? Something 20, like that, yeah. Got a two in front of yeah. it. We got I that. mean, I want to see that. Got that in common. Jonathan, Sam and Shaq. Not just that either. <laughs> what do you guys mean? Can you elaborate? I'm talking about the trouser oh. cannon. That's one thing. Chrissy, Sam and Brown, every show will be back tomorrow. Chrissy, Sam and Brown, every... Unless it's a weekend. Here's the 100.